Hello, Gemini. So this is your monthly read for August 2022. Take what resonates and leave the rest. All right, Spirit. What do you got for my Gemini babies for August 2022? We have the Ace of Wands. You have a fiery new beginning happening. We also have the King of Swords. I feel like that is you showing up in your own energy. Um, we have the Eight of Swords. You could be resistant with something. It's like, I am going to be resistant. I am guarding myself. I am protecting myself. I am not dealing with anything that is not for my greater good. And you have no problem cutting that shit out. We do have the Star card. You're choosing healing over everything else. This is a fiery new beginning with yourself. You also could be dealing with an Aquarius. You don't have to be. We have the Eight of Wands. And we also have the King of Wands. So you could be having some kind of fast coming communication from somebody um, that I feel like you possibly could have cut them off at some point. Or you're, you're battling it out with them. And I feel like that the communication is going to kind of go back and forth. But you're standing really strong. You're standing really strong. I feel like with the Eight of Swords, you're standing really strong. You have the blindfold on and you're like, it's my way or the highway. I don't see anything else. I don't hear anything else. This is how it's going to be. Bottom deck energy is the Lover's card. So you're also popping out in your own reading with the Lover's card. I feel like you are really wanting to make this connection or this person is really wanting to make a connection with you. But I'm not really sure that you're going for it. It's like you do want a fiery new beginning. But you're so resistant. With the King of Swords, you're being really resistant. And you're like, no. I feel like that you're cutting it off before it even begins. I feel like that you're just... You're either over something or you're just like not wanting to have anything to do with it. You're choosing healing over everything else. You're choosing yourself. And by you choosing yourself, this is probably why you're attracting this energy. You could be dealing with a fire sign, which is Sagittarius, Leo, Aries. But they're, they're trying to come in strong for you. And there is a love connection here. I do feel like that you have a love for them. But I also don't feel like you're making the full valid connection. Um... It's just, I see the resistance. There is a bunch of resistance to healing. So I do feel like that you are uh, definitely going to contemplate. I mean, you very well could come together. You very well could come together. You could also be dealing with another air sign, which is Gemini, Aries, or Gemini Aquarius, Libra. This is pretty cut and dry. So, you are going to have a little bit of resistance, but you might just give in. All right, Spirit, what energies are around my Gemini babies? What energies are around my Gemini babies for August? We have Gemini popping out. So maybe you are meeting another Gemini. You could be. What other en energies is around Gemini? We have air, which is... <laughs> which is Gemini, Aquarius, Libra. And then we have Aries. That could be your fire sign, possibly. We also have Scorpio. Bottom deck energy is Leo. So that's what I have for you for the month of August, Gemini. I'm sending you all kinds of love, light, healing, and protection. Have a great month, and I will talk to you soon.